So if I give them, let's say, well, this question, or I can give them, let's say, another question, but if you guys can just see that, so of course they need to identify that muscle. And one thing you will see is that, well, we have another muscle above it. So if they want, they can remove it and identify the right one. Or if I want to put it in kind of more in a clinical aspect, and if you look at the question that they have, so they need to kind of, first of all, understand what's the clinical condition. And then now they need to, again, identify the structure that is related, but it's not really showing in front of them. Therefore, they will have to dissect virtually in order to get to that structure. And of course, you can choose different levels of layers of how many things you want to have in front. But now once they open it, now they can identify and find the structure that they want. And this is something that is completely different from traditional way that's been used so far.